So, 16th of December. Uh, it's looking like a really good day. Plan is to go to Stanthorpe that way and then up north to Dalby and back 400 kilometers hopefully. Let's see how we get on. It's, everyone's going for So, just in my uh, first climb after release, airfield's just over there and uh, there was uh, th three gliders ahead of me. Yep, so uh, another four to be launched. Um, looking south, it's looking fairly good. I'm just going to take this climb all the way up to Cloudbase before I head off south because you need all the height you can get when you're going to Stanthorpe. Uh, looking good north as well. So I'm just approaching uh, Stanthorpe now, it's the uh, fruit growing region and uh, two gliders ahead of me, John and Phil, uh, at about 8,000 feet now so that's nice height, cloud base is uh, definitely climbing, that's good, and um, so I'm going to head to those clouds just on top of Stanthorpe turn there and um, then head north. So uh, let's see how we get on. So I've just passed uh, Warwick on my right, heading uh, north up to uh, Dolby. It's looking good ahead. Um, it's been cracking climbs. I'm at seven and a half at the moment. So uh, just uh, get a better climb hopefully under these clouds ahead and just keep push, pushing forward and eh? keep going so just approaching uh, Pittsworth now uh, I've got 82 to run to Dolby I think I'm gonna track um, a bit more to the left uh, looks better that way and um, it also keeps me clear of uh, Oki airspace uh, we check this morning they're not active but they could be active at any time and I'll just check on the, the flight radar to see if their uh, airspace is closed. But, uh, looking good so far, I'm, at, uh, I'm on six and a half thousand feet now so I'd like this climb here and run under me this cloud hopefully it'll work. And uh, I'll keep pushing north to Dolby. So I got past uh, Pittsworth and um, got a bit low just down there uh, near the road. Uh, so eventually I've got this climb, uh, it's got me up to cloud base. Uh, it's all blowing out coming in from the west. So I'm thinking of just pushing a bit further north before turning uh, to go back. Uh, fair way to uh, Dolby, yeah, it's still 60 kilometers. So let's see what happens with the clouds uh, along the route that I'm going to go, which is almost straight ahead now. So hopefully, I can. Yeah, so that's the traffic coming into uh, Toowoomba uh, Well Camp. Um, just to keep an, an ear out for things. Let's see how we get. So I've got to 9,000 feet and uh, I'm heading for Dolby now. Straight on my nose. And uh, it's almost completely uh, blue except on the horizon. So. Let's see what we can get on the way back. Uh, Matt and Andres are ahead somewhere. I'll give them a shout and see where they are. So I turned uh, Dolby behind me and uh, I'm now uh, heading back. I'm just under 9,000 feet. And according to this, I've almost got glide back into Warwick, so uh, pretty good. Uh, I'm just going to head straight back I think. I've got uh, 
112 kilometers to run. All blue now to the west, and the dying here. So uh, should be able to pick a lift in the blue. It's still um, heating on the ground, so and it's uh, now about quarter to three. So uh, time to go home. So I've got the Bravo Kilo above me here, and ahead is Oscar Papa. Um, we're all heading back to Warwick. So I haven't got Oscar Papa sighted now. Keep an eye out for him. Cloud's still further south. I'm just wondering if I can connect to it or not. So I've got Phil and Andres in front of me here. Uh, we're heading down to Kalani. Just keep an eye on what Andres is going to on his right. The race to Kalani. Clouds down there, so let's see what happens. Well, Phil might have something there, but I think he's pushing on still. Cracking day. Concentrate on staying in position and uh, let's see where we get in Kalani. So, follow the Cloud Street uh, to Kalani, uh, one in parallel with it, and now I've just headed off west. And uh, this is Stanthorpe coming up, and now uh, I've got easy glide back, and um, yeah. I think it's time to call it a day, it's after four o'clock. So I think time to get back on the ground. Cracking day, I mean, I can't believe just how good that was. I mean, I had a few moments when I uh, doubted myself and uh, got myself in a hole. And, but um, yeah, the day just kept on giving and after uh, three o'clock, it really got good. And. Uh, yeah, quite surprising. So, better than a day at work, that's for sure. So we're heading back to the airfield now. Came from that way over there, ran through, run underneath those clouds. Uh, it was really good fun. And uh, now I've got a nice easy glide back and uh, plenty of height. So I'll probably come in uh, over Leslie Dam and then uh, join the circuit. I'll switch to uh, the CTAP now and uh, yeah. Well, Phil's out there somewhere still. Uh, I haven't heard him on the radio, so I'll just uh, give him a shout and then go back. 